you have a dry enough environment, you can get electrostatic objects to kind of act like atoms. This is nothing other than a piece of foam with the styrofoam beads on it. This is just foam board. There's nothing here. These are just little foam balls that you'd get out of a normal cushion. So since they are dielectric, or what people call electrostatics, let's use a polarized field that's coherent and see what happens. They are moving against the wake front of magnetism, which is at the centrifugal edge, but the inverse will happen. Well, actually, let me pile drive over them at the center of the plane of inertia, and after I roll over them, if you will, there'll be a line of them right behind because they're actually attracted to the plane of inertia. These are just this, these are just styrofoam. <laughs> these are simply little tiny styrofoam balls. So, right now I'm obviously dragging the centrifugal. The centrifugal is the edge you will, the centrifugal edge. Let's actually put a little bit more. Nothing like picking this stuff up out of the carpet. Huh? Put a little bit more foam balls down there. Here we go. Now I'm not even touching anything. Not touching the foam or the foam boy. Now I am. can actually see what happens. Everything is inertia and acceleration and force in motion. I wish it were a little bit drier. It's slightly humid right now due to rain yesterday. If it's super really super dry, this would work extra spectacularly because there would be better repulsion. Some of them will actually, when it's really dry, I should have made the video when it was drier a couple days ago, jump up like they've been shot if the humidity is low enough. So anyway, I just thought I'd show you that. Real exciting stuff, huh? Actually the reason this magnet is curving is because about three feet away is that giant monster magnet. And if I actually just give it a little nudge, it'll actually fly towards there, and that wouldn't be good. That's actually, even though I'm pushing the magnet this way, it's wanting to curve towards the super magnet. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. That was real exciting, huh? Bye.